In the sprawling expanses of the cosmos, the quest for Planet Nine, a hypothetical behemoth purported to linger in the shadowy fringes of our solar system, has remained one of astronomy's most tantalizing puzzles. From early teachings, Newtonian dynamics have guided our understanding of planetary motions and celestial phenomena. Yet, sometimes, the universe invites us to reconceptualize our foundational knowledge, inspiring a pursuit into the arcane possibilities of celestial mechanics and gravitational theories. This brings us to a provocative hypothesis. Could the answer to the perplexing orbital paths of certain Kuiper Belt objects, KBOs, be embedded not in the discovery of a new distant planet, but rather in a redefinition of our gravitational understanding through modified Newtonian dynamics, MOND. Stretching beyond the orbit of Neptune, the Kuiper Belt is a vast region enveloping numerous icy bodies, remnants from the solar system's primordial times. The celestial ballet of these objects orbiting in the remote reaches of our solar system has become the centrifuge of the Planet Nine debate. A pattern in the seemingly peculiar orbits of these distant objects points scientists towards a hypothetical planet. A giant estimated to be five times Earth's size and situated at an approximate distance of 500 times farther from the Sun. Yet, despite the advanced telescopic technology and the tireless gaze of astronomers, Planet Nine remains conspicuously elusive. Doctors Catherine Brown and Harsh Mathur, with their roots anchored in Hamilton College and Case Western Reserve University, respectively, posit an intriguing alternative. What if the odd, distant orbits of KBOs can be explained not by an unseen planetary mass, but through the lens of modified Newtonian dynamics? MOND, with its prior successes in elucidating the dynamics of galactic rotation, offers a framework wherein gravitational mechanics are perceived differently, particularly in regions where gravitational forces are weak. The theory posits that as an object is farther from a dominating gravitational source, in this instance, the Sun, it becomes progressively influenced by extraneous gravitational forces, like those from the galaxy's core. Under the encompassing gravitational influence of our galaxy's core, bodies in the far reaches of the solar system, such as the KBOs, experience altered orbital paths. This is manifested in two principal ways. According to Brown and Mathur, the major axes of these objects align toward the galactic core, and the minor axes align perpendicular to it. These alterations in their celestial arcs are not mere theoretical musings, but are echoed by observational data with many KBOs adhering strikingly to these predicted orbital characteristics. Thus, the enigmatic orbits, which were initially heralded as proof of Planet Nine's existence, might indeed be a testament to a different gravitational tale, narrated by the distant, yet pervasively influential, galactic core. Weighing the Possibilities – A New Planet or a Paradigm Shift in Gravity the enthralling possibility of unmasking a new colossal planet within our cosmic neighborhood is, without a doubt, a mesmerizing prospect. But the elegance and simplicity offered by MOND can't be dismissed. By reframing our perspective on gravitational physics, this theory doesn't merely offer an answer to the KBO's peculiar orbits, but invites a re-evaluation of our grasp on celestial mechanics on a universal scale. It reopens conversations about dark matter, galactic formations, and the true fabric of our universe. While the MOND theory could illuminate the shadowy dynamics of distant celestial bodies, it does not necessarily extinguish the possibility of Planet Nine's existence. We stand at a cosmic crossroad, with pathways leading towards further explorations, powered by forthcoming technological advancements in astronomy. Whether future telescopic endeavors reveal a distant planetary giant or, or further substantiate the influence of modified gravitational dynamics, our journey through these celestial investigations will undoubtedly propel our understanding of the universe forward, spiraling into new realms of cosmic knowledge and discovery. 
In essence, the pursuit of Planet Nine and the exploration into the depths of gravitational theories through MOND present not merely a quest for celestial understanding, but a philosophical expedition into how we perceive, comprehend, and engage with the vast, mysterious cosmos. Regardless of the conclusions drawn in the upcoming years, whether we identify a new planetary member or delve deeper into the unseen gravitational threads weaving through our galaxy, our celestial curiosity will forge onward, ever propelling us into the enigmatic abyss of the universe.